Because I can explain. You know that Ryder doesn't belong with him. Ryder belongs with who he loves, and it's not you. It's never going to be you, and you're out of the hunters. I can't believe you of all people are taking a wolf's side. Yeah, well, that wolf's never done what you've done. You're insane, Dustin, and we don't want that here. Fine, but I promise you'll live to regret this. I already do. Patch him up and get him the hell out of here. I'm so sorry that I almost lost it. I almost killed him. Don't worry, Ethan. You did keep control. It's fine. Ryder, you were the only reason that I kept control. If you weren't there, I would have ripped him apart. You would have had good reason to, so don't feel bad, okay? It's over. Sorry, Ryder, but I don't believe it's over. I don't think Dustin's going to walk away. Ethan, don't worry about it. The hunters will take care of it. It'll be fine. No, I will take care of you. But damn, Ethan. I definitely like the sound of that. Tom, I miss this. Wish we could stay here forever. So do I, Bryce. But we both have to face reality. I've got to find my brother. You've got to deal with your father. I know all that. But can I have one more hour? I'm just looking at you. You can definitely have one more hour. But you're not just going to be looking. Can't lose you, Christian. If I do, I don't know what I'll do. I promise you, Bryce, I'm not going anywhere. So, little brother, we've gone to Maiden and Crips now. I heard you went by father's. How'd that go? Comet Max, you know exactly how that went. You and father have to stop this. We're not going to stop this. This is our time. We've been through hell and back. We're not going to let the humans get away with any of this. Not anymore. Max, I am so sorry for everything that's happened to you. It's all my fault. It started with me. Oh, little brother, I appreciate that and I love you. But it didn't start with you. It started with the humans and the hunters. And they're going to pay. What happened to my brother? No, I'd totally do anything for you. So what do you need, Cassandra? I need a way to get Gerald away from Bastion so that he doesn't fall deeper in love with him. Wow, I don't know. I mean, they've totally got 200 years of history when he was hiding. How are you going to compete with that? Believe me, I'm well aware of their history. But Bastion loves me. Of course he does. But I mean, Gerald is like his protector, his savior. He's not just going to walk away from him. I guess I would just have to destroy him. It's the only way. But you better be sure that he's going to forgive you. Wait a minute, I'm sorry. You're telling me that my son is not a hunter and he's a wolf? What the hell? It's my fault. I was afraid of losing him. I didn't want him to leave me. My son loved you. He was never going to leave you. You ruined him. Forever. He's not a hunter anymore. Father, please don't blame her. I'm okay with this now. You have to be too. She didn't give me much of a choice, did she, son? I swear to you that I will keep him safe and I will take care of him. Always. Better, because I have no choice but to trust you. I'm sorry about this, Dad. I really am. Well, it's pretty much all gone to hell in the handbasket. Ryder's okay, but Dustin's a nut. Yeah, well, I always thought he was a weird kid. Don't worry. Ryder will be okay. Yeah, well, that's the least of our problems. We still gotta deal with these rogue wolves, and something's going on with Riley. Well, babe, sounds like you've got a lot on your plate. Good thing I'm here to help. Honestly, Drake, I don't know what I'd do without you. You're my rock. I know that, babe. And we're gonna get through this. We're gonna defeat those wolves, don't worry. Damn it, no, I've got a really bad feeling about this. We've got to find my father. Afraid it's already too late for that. Max challenged him. He went to the woods. Damn it, no, we can't let him go alone. We have to go after him. Max and we can't, you know the rules. They have to fight. Whoever wins, wins. But that's when it's a fair fight, and we know it's not. Our father knows what he's getting into. Yeah, well, if Max defeats him, the pack is his. Then what are we going to do? We do what we have to to survive, as always. Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. I didn't think there was anyone in here. He's a man as handsome as you, never has to apologize. What's your name? Forgive me, where are my manners? Joseph. It's nice to meet you, Joseph. I'm Amanda, and I do hope you come here often. Actually, I do. My brothers think it's silly, but I love to read. There's nothing wrong with a smart man. I find it very, very sexy. Thank you. I, I have to get going. I'm supposed to be at a meeting. I'm sorry. Perhaps you and I could meet for coffee tomorrow. Yes, I'd like that. mine now. Ah, oh, Bastion, my boy, have you come to your senses and you're ready to come home? No, Father, I'm trying to save you and Max. You have to listen to me. This is insane. Son, there's nothing insane about it. We are the strongest species. We should rule. Father, I understand that you're hurt. You and Max have been through terrible things. But please, don't do this. My name has never been respected or feared, but it will now, and you will be with us. Please, Father, this is all my fault. Please tell me I can still save you. I don't need saving, son. 
What do you think of my new place? Like it? Please travel anywhere with you, our love. Yeah, I like the sound of that. Just you and me. You've got me. Forever. I'm not going anywhere. You know that. You're all mine. Oh, you're the only one that I love. Alright guys, I'm not going to sugarcoat this, it's really bad. Riley's a wolf now, and Dustin's out of the hunters, and we've got major problems. Whoa, hang on a minute, when the hell did Riley become a wolf? And we all knew Dustin was getting kicked out. This is totally just great, we're all in trouble now. Are we even supposed to deal with this? Guys, we deal with it together as we always have. That's right, we're a team, we're hunters. We're not giving up the fight, ever. You know we're with you 100%, no matter what. Alright, innocent lives come first. Chrissy, thank God we got you out of there. Please tell me that you're all right. Christian, I'm okay. I love Kyle. You have to let him go. Chrissy, no. He's insane. We cannot let him go. Christian, please. He only did what he did for me. Guys, your father has been looking for you. I'm glad that you're here. Don't shut up and don't you say a word about my father. You believe you are nothing like him, but you are. I am nothing like him. My father's a cold-blooded killer. I'm not. Just by your message and the look on your face didn't go well with Sebastian. Don't you worry, your brother will be on board whether he wants to or not. If everything's going according to your plan, I defeated Joseph, the pack's mine. As of course it is, I had no doubt, but you have your own pack. So, let's move on to bigger things. We have to get your brother and your son and leave. Are oh, you serious? They want to go back to the old country after the way they treated us. I like America better. We have old schools to settle. Once we do that, we can come back here. Hey, father. Let's do this. I know he looks bad, but don't worry. He's going to be fine. How can you say he's going to be fine, Gerald? He lost the pack. And what exactly does this mean for us? You guys know what it means. It's going to be an absolute trouble. I guess we don't have a choice. We'll have to listen to Max, don't we? I'm sorry. There's nothing I could do about that. You'll have to listen to your alpha until we can figure this out. I'll listen to him. We know what he wants. He wants to destroy everything. So I want him not killing anyone. Especially not innocent people. He'd really make us do that. Kill innocents. See, Willie's done it before. Well, now you're in charge and you're no found leadership. As a matter of fact, I am. And I sent my boys out to go find yours. I appreciate that. I gotta leave town for a little while. But the old man's really gonna go back there. I see as he's a stubborn old bastard and he wants to take down the rest of the pox. I wish you good luck and a fast return. Don't you worry, while I'm gone, my pack will take care of things. Sandra, I'm sorry I'm so distracted, but between my father, my brother, Bastard, my love, you never have to apologize to me. I know it's upsetting you. I just thought I could get through to them. I knew I could, but I can't. It's like I don't know them anymore. I'm sorry, my love, but they have changed, I told you. As a mother, Cassandra, through my family, I'm never going to give up on them. Of course, my love, I know you won't. Why don't you let Gerald handle it? I can't ask Gerald to do this. He loves me too much. He would. He'd get killed. I won't let that happen. I honestly didn't expect this to happen when we went to get coffee. What he's saying, you're not glad it did? I'm sorry I didn't mean it like that. It's just I'm usually not this forward. Not after the breakup I had. Joseph, whoever she was, is a fool. I would never let you go. I know what it is about you, Amanda. But there's something. I'm not that complicated, Joseph. You'll find out. Yes, I'd very much like to. That's about time you got here. No. You definitely are as handsome as your father. Hello, Bryce. Time, son, we're leaving. No, I'm not going anywhere with you. I told you I'm not a killer. I'm not like you. Guys, you are a bane. You cannot deny it. It's in you. You are one of us. And you know you got that killer instinct, son. I'm not giving me much of a choice. Guys, there's only one choice. Family. 